Hello guys! It's been a while since I posted a video. Been insanely busy with my daytime work for quite a few weeks. Haven't had much time or energy. Uh, hardly even painted, uh, but making videos and uploading that has not been high on my list of priorities. But this whole coronavirus business is slowing down my work. So I guess I will have some time on my hands in the coming weeks or even months. So on the upside, I'll get to relax a bit and do more painting. Um, hopefully the overall economy will be okay. Hope you out there are doing okay as well. Uh, be careful. Take care of your loved ones. Anyway, so I'm back to my usual burnt amber, white, black, silver and gold mix. Um, the shop around the corner uh, just started stocking round canvases, so I thought I would have a go at that. This is a 30 centimeter diameter canvas. The paints are mixed with yet another pouring medium mix. I've kind of fallen in love with the Amsterdam Acrylics pouring medium. So this is about three parts clear craft glue, uh, one part uh, Amsterdam pouring medium and one part water. Thinking I might have mixed the paints a bit too thin. We'll have to see how it goes. Anyway, let's flip. Okay not used to the round canvas so let's see how i'm going to move the paint around here i'm going to keep some of that black down here because at the moment it's looking quite golden which is nice but i do want to see some of the other colors in here as well i just have to see how that goes uh, at least there's more than enough paint on the canvas that is quite clear. Um, okay, so it started going over the edge. Um, I think I'll torch. There are quite a few air bubbles as well. Don't like those. Um, let's see how much of those I want to torch without getting like a massive cell explosion. Yeah, I have to be very careful about that. Oh, the cells are looking nice though. Shaping up beautifully. And some more action down here. Probably not that much silicone. Okay. So this is looking quite good, isn't it? Lacking a bit cell action down here, so I'll have to try and move some paint off that way. Probably lose these, but oh well. I think I'm going to carefully tilt over this edge first. 
because I don't want to lose this black bit but I need some paint on the side here so start going that way carefully it's a bit different tilting a round canvas rather than a square one uh, I'm not sure how this is going to go Covered. Oh no, not really. Okay. Ah, there we go. Okay, not looking too shabby. Oh, there's some split paints over here. Spectre has to do with the torching. Um, uh, oh well. Okay, I'm going to lose some of those black cells over at the edge there. But then again, I'll get to stretch the other ones quite nicely. Looking nice and big. Um, hmm. Do I want to do that or not? Hmm. Tempted. Yeah, I'm going to move the paint towards myself a bit. Oh, look at that. Okay, I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, go around, touch up the corners a bit, or corners, uh -huh. not corners. There are some white spots around some of the edges. I'm just gonna. Okay, sorry, I'm going to dive in to have a look at the back. Uh, move that forward again. Just leave it there, and there, and there. Oh, come on. Okay, I think I managed to keep my t shirt off. Yep. Okay. Okay. Quite happy with that. Hopefully, it dries nicely as well. Um, see if I can photograph it. I need to figure out how to um, crop it like in the round shape. I'll post a photo of it at the end of the video. Um, yeah, feel free to let me know what you think. And thank you for watching. Goodbye.